Please take your seats quickly, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Hi guys, and welcome to OneMinuteTennis.com. In today's session, we're gonna talk about how to destroy easy, high, floated balls. And the most important thing to consistently destroy that ball and put it away first time every time is that you know your range. Now the easy high floated ball is a ball that almost every player wants to destroy. We see pro players all the time just coming in and obliterating that ball, smashing them into the corners. But for recreational players, in fact for players of even a very high level, this is not so easy. I've seen international veteran players who will slice that ball and then play the volley. And even if they win the point with that strategy, they're still frustrated. Because what they really want to do is come in and like Federer and Nadal and all the others, just destroy that ball. And when players are trying to get better at this high ball and acquire the skill to put this ball away, they're nearly always focusing on their technique. What do I have to do to change to put this ball away? How can I stop missing this high ball? How can I be confident with this high ball? But for most of the players watching this, the answer is not technique. The answer is to find your range. Now your range will be different to my range, which is gonna be very different to Roger Federer's range, but we all have a range. And what I mean by that is you need to be aware clearly at what part of the court you can actually really attack these balls with confidence. And I'm pretty sure that most of the players here don't know their range. You see, if the ball bounces high and it's this close to the net, is that inside your range? If the ball bounces high and it's this close to the net, is that inside your range? If the ball bounces high and it's this far, from the net. Is that inside your range? You need to know where on the court you can confidently attack these balls. And to find your range is pretty simple. We can self-feed and do it. And we begin by making it incredibly easy. So let's start by being just about an arm's length and a racket's length away from the net. And then you simply throw the ball up and hammer it away. And this is inside my range. And now take a step back, throw the ball up, make sure that the bounce is gonna be above net height. This was too low. And this is still within my range. And now take a step back and again, repeat the process. And now maybe I've found my range. So now we repeat the whole thing several times and in the same distance from the net here, bounce the ball. And this is obviously within my range. If you keep practicing the high ball, and first of all, you overcompensate, you go obviously too close to the net. And then making sure that you drive the ball off a self-feed, you work your way further and further back until you find the position where you start to make errors. Maybe even if it's one in three, it's too many. Now you've found your range. And this means that when you next play, when the ball drops inside your range, you don't have to think, oh, shall I go for it? Or shall I slice it? Or shall I play safe? Or shall I place the ball? No, you know the ball is inside your range. And when you know the ball is inside your range, then there's no decision to make. You're gonna obliterate that ball. As you do this, your confidence will grow because you'll stop making bad decisions or stop thinking when you should be doing. Because if we're thinking, shall I go for it or not? That's where the bad errors really occur. Find your range. Apply your range to your game and you'll start to obliterate high balls with confidence and with consistency. I hope this makes sense. I'd love to know how it works for you or for the players that you coach. You know we try to reply to every single comment. To practice high balls or any other part of your game, have a look at our partners, playyourcourt.com. They send professional tennis coaches to your local courts or they find players of your level to practice with in your local area. It's a terrific service. It really helps people's game and it's very inexpensive. There's a 50% discount off their membership if you click the link in the comment section below. And if you want help like this or other help in your game, have a look at what we can do with online coaching. We're helping players of all ages, all levels, and all over the world with a unique blend of video analysis and personalized lessons such as this. Email us for more information or have a look at the website. But remember, don't overcomplicate the technique. If you've got a solid forehand, then you can put away high balls. The key is you've got to know your range. Find your range, apply it to your game, and start to be a more aggressive and successful tennis player today. 
Thanks for watching. See you next time for more unique tennis lessons that really work.